this viral child on KBC was not being bad. I think it's not about badness. It's about understanding biology. Understand three very important neurological truth about kids, especially if you're parents. Number one, no child is born with sense of time. We are not born with a watch in our hand. The whole idea of patience and impatience is the concept created by humans. So the whole behavior of, of the child, uh, the whole impatience is very natural. We are born with that. It's there in every animal. It's a matter of just few thousand years in the evolution when we started agriculture. Agriculture is the perfect example of patience. It's an art of delayed gratification. For the first time, human took the seed in the hand and said, I will not eat it, threw on the ground and ready to wait for one season for the plant to so get more seeds. That's the art, art of patience. Child is not born with it. It's a responsibility of parents to teach a child why to wait and the importance of patience. They're not naturally born with it, number one. Number two, I think this child is around five in fifth standard. And at this age, your amygdala, which is your fear center, your emotional center, your basal ganglia, which is your habit center, all these parts of the brain are fully active. But the part of the brain, which is your prefrontal cortex, which is your CEO, which is the brain part, which is responsible for logic, for focus, for patience, is still under construction. And especially those kids who are learning some complex skills like singing or some kind of instruments or chess where the extreme intense focus is required, they are strengthening prefrontal cortex. It's, an, it's like an exercise for prefrontal cortex. But kids, if not learning any skill, any complex skill, then it's very weak compared to your ancient part. So the child doesn't have the biological capacity only to handle that feeling that I want to be patient here. I want, I want to wait here. No biological capacity. Third, you have to understand, ladies and gentlemen, that the behavior that I don't care who is sitting in front of me, that Mr. Amitabh Bachchan is sitting in front of him, ideally he should be very respectful. But the behavior that I don't care who is sitting in front of me, I can behave the way I want to behave, is a reflection of this, the point that at the home or environment, or he's living in the environment where every action or every behavior is acceptable. Why? He's just a child. Just a child. And the child starts internalizing this, start believing in this, that I can't do anything wrong. Whatever I'm doing, it's right only. So there's no logic here to blame that child. Blaming the child is like blaming a sapling for not bearing fruits. It's biologically impossible for that sapling, for that child. 